Buenos dias, some of my morning walk with baby Eve Eve and ghost and today's Friday and I'm getting all my exercises done on the proper days minus skipping my my grip workout and today is leg day so I'm gonna do legs today when I get a chance by myself and I haven't done legs to be honest with you look at my channel I haven't done legs and I think this uh, the whole month of October so it's been a whole month of not doing legs and let's see how weak I got by not doing legs for one month. From my understanding is after after two weeks of not working out, you start you start regressing. But there's a thing called muscle memory, so the strength comes back uh, fairly quickly, and muscle, especially when you start bulking. So that's what's gonna happen. That's the um, that's the whole process. I'll quickly go over it. When you when you're when you're bulking, you eat more calories than your body needs to put on the muscle and then you need to cut to burn the fat but still work out to keep the muscle as much muscle as you can you're going to lose muscle as you're losing um, as your body has to burn fat for energy and I think also burn some muscle so you lose strength and for some reason when you lose fat you lose strength when you gain fat you gain strength even when you're not putting on muscle and that's the the quick Coles Notes version of that and uh, thank you for watching my channel. I appreciate the support. Like and subscribe if you're not a little bitch. And, and come back, come back uh, tomorrow. And I might, I might do something else. Now, actually, no, tomorrow, tomorrow morning, I'm headed to Canada. So we'll be in Canada. And on Monday, I'll be doing exercises with Aiden. I think we'll do, um, there's a calisthenics park. Maybe we'll do some unique content there. And then I'll find a gym to go to. And if I can't do that, I'll do some uh, home workout stuff. And that's it. Uh, I said I was done, but now I'm done. Uh, like and subscribe. See bye, Eve. Buenas noches. It's nighttime. I'm doing my workout late. It's 7 o'clock in Managua. And here it gets dark around uh, 6 o'clock. And I'm going to do my leg day, like I said in the intro. And the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to warm up with uh, the barbell, 135 on the barbell. And I'm going to do it 10 times, nice and slow. Down and up, get a nice stretch at the bottom, go as low, get ass to grass, low as I can possibly go. And then I'll, I'll do a working set, one set to failure, on, on the squats, and on every other exercise after that. And easy peasy, lemon squeezy. 135, ass to grass, cats are watching. Not sure if they're on camera. My microphone's only at 20%, so I might die during this workout. I haven't squatted in a month. And if you listen carefully, you hear everything cracking. <laughs> and onto the working set. And with the working set, I added another 50 pounds, so 185. Last time I did this, I got eight reps. Um, but Aiden was here to spot me. And uh, this gets a little tricky when I get stuck at the bottom. I got a bail on these bottom pins, so I gotta make sure they're in place. And let's see if I can get eight reps. With 185, the cats, the cats can spot me. Four. 
I knew on four that I was going to get five, but I still tried. And I need to lower the weight by 10 pounds. And I should really get the eight reps. My goal is to fail between eight and 10 reps. And I got four, so I got to drop 10 pounds. So 175 next week. And on to the next exercise. Okay, the next exercise is the RDLs, Romanian deadlifts. And four weeks ago, it says I did 290 for eight, which well, I've been doing for a while before I stopped lifting my RDLs. But uh, if you watched my, my back and bicep days, you know that my deadlift strength has gone down during the cut the last couple of weeks. So instead of doing 290, I'm going to do 255. I'm going to drop it down by... Was that 35 pounds? And I should really get I should really get eight to ten reps, just to be safe. And uh, if I get more than ten reps, I'll add more weight. But I doubt I will. Let's see what happens. Always chalk up when you're doing deadlift. It uh, helps a lot with the grip, and use a mixed grip, especially with, while doing RDLs, because the barbell doesn't touch the ground and you need to regrip. Then you're gonna get less reps in. So. So at nine, so uh, 255 is a good weight. So I'm gonna keep it at that. And on to the next exercise. Okay, next exercise is the leg extensions. Last time I did this four weeks ago, I did 120 for nine reps, but I, I know my strength's gonna be down. So I have 90 plus 25, 115 on here. And let's see if I can get eight to 10 reps. So eight reps, and whenever I can, I try to push, have that static hold for 10 seconds at the end. And so that's, uh, that's it, fucking one set to failure. That's all you need, I'm gonna keep saying it, keep repeating it, same, same shit over and over again. And I don't know if you can see my, my legs, two year progress. And on to the next exercise. Oh shit, it's still recording. And the next exercise is the leg leg curls. 
Last time I did uh, 60 pounds for eight reps. Is it eight or nine? It was for, for eight. So I dropped it by five, so 55 pounds. And I should be able to get eight, eight reps again. And let's see what I can do here. Put the mic right in front of my face. You can hear me breathing deeply. Come on. Two, three, four, five, six. Fuck, I said the last number I did, but I don't remember what that number was. I need to rewatch, rewatch and write down my, my heavy app, what I did. And that's it, fucking high intensity, one set, balls to the wall, and try to push in the last rep, and then go on to the last exercise, the calves. Never neglect your calves. And the last exercise, calf raises. And this is why I do my calf raises. Grab a 25 pound. Weight, I'll hold it in my left hand when I do my left leg, and then I'll hold it in my right hand when I do my, my right leg. And sometimes there are flip flops, but I'm gonna go, I'm gonna raw dog this one, even though it hurts. It hurts quite a bit. Get my toes in a good position. And I do calf raises. This shit hurts a lot. Kiss try like this. No, fuck, I need flip flops. I'll be back with my flip flops. And I'm back with the flip flops. It's gonna feel much better. Put my hand over here for balance. Yeah, that's much better. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Whew. Crazy burn in the calf. I call that 20 even though they weren't full, full range of motion. And then do 20 at the other foot. Switch hands. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. And that's it. That's the whole leg workout. Let's go see, see how long that, that took. So I got 20 on each foot. I'm gonna finish my workout. It's a, and it's at 30 minutes. So I pause my workout. It only took 30 minutes. Leg day is done faster than most people, uh, faster than it takes most people to even get to the gym and do the first set. And that's the greatest benefit. Once it's a failure, doesn't matter how fucking busy you are, you can always get it in. And if you need help with your workouts, your nutrition, or anything, uh, contact me. My information will be down below. And uh, I'll help you with some coaching. And that's it. Thank you for watching. I appreciate the support. Like and subscribe if you're not a little bitch. And next workout will be Monday. Today's Friday. So after the weekend. And I'll be in Canada figuring out what kind of exercises I should do. And have a good night. Buenas noches.